So let's look at some natural remedies. Well, number one is actually getting plenty of rest. You need to rest so that you can actually in, ensure that you have proper energy stored so the body never gets run down. Number two, we need to drink plenty of fluids, of water, because water is what keeps you functional alive. And if you haven't seen the, my video on water, go into the website and find it under um, superfoods. The third thing that you can help boost your immune system is a natural thing that you can get. It's basically this, garlic. Garlic has a natural enzyme in it that actually helps boost the immune system. I know a lot of people love garlic and some people don't like garlic. Well, because it has a potent smell. Well, one of the things you can do easily, and this is what I do, is that I take one clove of garlic like this, and I would skin it, and I would take the skin off, and take the clove off, and I'll skin this off here, and then once I skin it off, and you get into the white part, what happens is that you can take that garlic, and I would chop it up into small little pieces. Chopping into small pieces, now you have two things you can do right here. Number one, you can... Um, swallow that and with a glass of water or if you really don't like the taste of raw garlic which most people don't you can ha add a tablespoon of honey raw honey because otherwise you, you pasteurize honey is actually just pure sugar raw honey at least has some antibacterial properties in, in it so that you use raw honey mix it with the garlic and you put it in your mouth and you swallow the glass of water at least it gets inside of you there's a property in raw garlic that has an enzyme that actually helps boost the immune system that is what's going to help you increase that immune system so that your body functions better and gets rid of it. And I would take one clove a day for about three to five days, depending on how long this flu lasts for. And this is a great way to help protect yourself, but also during the process, you can help it, um, help get through it too as well. The fourth thing you can do is also getting some lemon honey tea. That's a great way because you're putting natural honey in there and, and using raw honey, you take one tablespoon of raw honey with a squeeze of lemon. Lemon is fantastic. One slice of lemon, squeeze it with some hot water and that's a great way to soothe the throat and it actually help you um, get enough sugar so that, you know, at least to keep you keep your energy at a high rate. What you don't want to be doing at this moment to lower the immune system is they don't want to be eating complex foods. Anything that comes out of a box usually is hard to digest and, and break down for your body. So it takes energy away from where it needs to be fighting it to actually break down the food source. So what you want to do at this point is eat simple foods, natural foods, like fruit. Fruit has a lot of natural sugars that will give you the energy that you need to kind of survive to get through the day and actually help you get enough energy to kill the virus and bacteria, but it's not hard to digest. And that's a great way to actually increase your energy. And I would eat fruit every couple hours, just a little bit of time, like watermelon and, 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 and rock melons and whatever fruits in season. It just helps you get through it. So I really hope that these helpful hints get you through this winter and um, will help you allow you to, to increase your immune system and hope that it helps you and your family feel better over this time. Realize that flu is not meant for you to be able to still continue to go to work and do the normal things that you know. That they're supposed to knock you out a little bit and spend the energy to save your life. Remember, that's what it's doing. Your energy is required to save your life, which is much more important than you going to, to, to work and work on that particular project. Okay, So I hope that helps you through this winter. If there's any other helpful hints that you require, please feel free to ask me or email me. Um, I also have an upcoming event that's, uh, that I'll be talking to you about. I'll probably send you an e email in the next couple of days about it. It's going to be a great, fantastic event. It's a little thank you from myself uh, and my staff to you guys. And uh, we'll get tons of prizes for you. And if you have uh, re got um, your invitation for it, great. I will invite you formally in a couple of days. And I uh, look forward to, uh, to talking about that. Take care. I hope this is Dr. Lawrence Tam. I'll see you later.